hello guys we have a question from pathfinder again this is from rotation uh, from build up your understanding question number two so I'll, let's look at it a thread is wound on two identical bobbins placed on a horizontal floor with their axis parallel radius of the outer flanges of the bobbins is eta times that of the inner spools the midpoint of the thread is pulled vertically upwards with constant velocity u if the bobbins roll on the floor without slipping find the velocity of approach of their centers when angle between the thread segments become two theta so yeah, basically here again we have the same uh, logic we used in uh, build up understanding question number one that along the two points on rigid body the velocity uh, relative velocity should be zero and so uh, here the velocity of the center of uh, the bobbin will be omega times eta r and that of the that of thread with uh, contact of the contact point of the thread with the bobbin it will be shown as omega r along the thread and omega eta r in the horizontal direction which can be again be uh, taken from the result that uh, velocity of the other point is the velocity of that point plus omega times uh, r so from here what we get is the velocity along the thread of, of the two points should be zero so from here we, we get that u cos theta should be equals to omega r plus omega eta r times cos of 90 minus theta because this angle here is 90 minus theta so from here what we get is u cos theta equals to omega r times 1 plus eta sine theta so from here omega r equals to u cos theta by 1 plus eta sine theta and the required velocity is the velocity of approach of the two bobbins which is 2 omega eta r so from here 2 omega eta r equals to 2 u cos theta over 1 plus eta sine theta so yeah this is the final answer thank you